Hey gang, I hope you guys are doing great. And here I am in my coca jar corner with my tree of life. So today's segment is really about finding where we at because the new moon is coming up one week from now and it's a time where we write our new intention our new intention on what we're looking to do for the next literally end of the year because once we start to go into the nine which is finally the time that we are needed to really sort out our life and really execute our plan of action because if we keep on living each day the way we wake up do things and we really kind of being a robot with no plans and so are we living our life like that waking up in the morning brushing our teeth doing our hair makeup whatever you know and going out to do our exercise or walking or things like that we just kind of do our everyday thing we're walking and working like robots because you got to remember and so far since my other segment i did for the new moon is we talked about three elements which so far it's trickling down water right water and of course the lion gates portal that opened up on the eighth is fire so we had a lot of these things going all over the world it doesn't matter if you are in hawaii with that huge wave of water flooding or if you are in somewhere out in paris they have flooding it's all over the world where even where some of the dams are really lifting up bodies from the dead and so a lot of these changes are shifting is because we just entered our last super moon of the year which is giving the last huge vibration to wake up everybody because we're gonna go in for a long ride like the flood the flood gate has opened you know whether it's you call it the water gate or the flood gate it has already erupted we talked about last month about narcissistic people and a people who has done wrong to humanity a lot of people who has done things like let's say if they take money from chemical companies whether they are monsanto which they spray a whole bunch of the crops of our food which is next was on the list right so we had the water we had the fire with the portal opening with the lion's gate that's how the fire goes through and next like i mentioned the food has already started right the lack of food the lack of energy a lot of these things are really not vibrating what the what nature calls for because things are now making in the laboratory whether you call it lab food or some of these things I, I i really don't know what they make these things out of out of plants and they put some something else and they make it look like me i i, it, I don't really keep up because i'm not really into all of that but if you are Make sure you guys look and understand what they're actually making. As far as dog food is concerned, that's another thing. And I'm not gonna go into that because you can see everything and everything about dogs on my other YouTube segments, as well as our website at cocajor.com. That's C-O-C-O-J-O-R.com and we have a lot of webinars and you know very interesting courses and how to detox and understand about water with our method with coco jar so jumping right back to getting what we need to do for the upcoming week to prepare ourselves because some people is 
feel the new moon three new moon or full moon three days prior some people use the method of doing it from that day plus three days you know that so six day and on the seventh day you need to pray in all that new intention and give you that guidance to you know because you already planted a seed you've already decided what you want to do and so it's so important that in September the 9th is really going back and encompassing yourself, your soul, back to who you are, what you are, what you really want for 2023. Because it takes a while for things to harvest. You can't expect, you know, from the seed you're going to be eating tomatoes the next month. And so it can happen. It all depends on what kind of attention, love, energy, vibration, nutrition. It's like this. This is Lily was a tree. But I was very fortunate that they kept it and, and made it where you can feel that energy. And so really take time to really spend, you have one week to get yourself ready because there's a lot of things, like I said, so food is really gonna start to really pop up into the bigger segment <clears throat> in September because it's, it's equal to nutrition, it's equal to that nine. And we also, need to really have any look into technology why because we have a mercury retrograde coming up soon so there is a lot of things of checklists that we can do over the weekend you know if we have given ourselves that space of five minutes ten minutes it's really worth it to really give you that mind space to really deep think, concentrate, meditate, because it's you. And live each life with a lot of peacefulness, a lot of bliss, and most of all, clarity to help you with all these problematic things that could be arising. So you're ready to, because you have the solution, because you have clarity and guidance and make sure you are rooted and balanced. So you take care. I'll be coming back soon with our next upcoming August 27th, one week from now, really the new moon. So you stay tuned, have a wonderful weekend and most of all, aloha. Remember, stay in touch with your tree of life. Namaste.